There are some bumps in the road for the CEO of Hart, the Hillsborough Regional Transit Authority. Some employees are calling on their leader to resign, saying she's creating a hostile work environment. Brittany Muller joins us now live in Tampa. And Brittany, Hart's board has launched an investigation, right? It has just this morning it launched that investigation and the board says next week it'll determine whether to keep suspend or terminate the CEO and it comes as morale is low according to the union. As heart employees claim hostility at work created by leadership. Get somebody in here that can lead this organization. You know it's not about the union. It's not about them. It's about the workers who are willing to come to work and do their job. But it's just, it's very hostile for them to even come and perform their duties. The union representing heart employees is calling for CEO Adelie Legrand's resignation. It says 57 employees have either quit or have been fired under her leadership. Under my leadership, everyone at heart has to work and they have to be held accountable. And a part of that journey, some people will decide that they want to get off the bus. And we'll open the door for them. Legrand says between 2018 and when she stepped in January 2021, Hart had six CEOs. It is difficult to have an organization with 800 employees who very frequently are changing direction, have no understanding of what the vision is, don't really understand their role in the vision, to then get someone who's here who's really focused on driving change. Commissioner Gwen Myers says the investigation will also reveal if former Top Heart employee Terry Wright will have to pay some of her salary back. After it was discovered, she was employed and paid by both Hart and New Orleans Regional Transit Authority at the same time. Let's investigate all the CEO, former employees and current employees to get to the bottom of what's this so-called um, toxic work environment. That is not good for Hillsborough County. When asked about employees calling for LeGrand's resignation, she says she serves at the pleasure of Hart's board. Now, as for next week's meeting, we'll keep you updated. Reporting live in Tampa tonight, Brittany Muller, 8 on your side.